Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we are playing Grotopia, and there's been a new update. Pineapple event has left, and we now have a brand new update. Let's do slash news and check it out. I'm gonna go ahead and read this. Sit back and enjoy. It's quite a read. Pet battles. Pet battles are here. June 11th. Haven't you always wanted to see if your Panadma Demalo can beat your friend's Demarudosaurus? Haven't you always wondered what these words even mean? Now you can find out in the biggest update Grotopia has ever seen. We've added nearly 40 new items, over 70 pet abilities to the game, along with a whole pile of new features. Pet battles are an advanced feature. We're not going to tell you how to get all the items, but we can tell you that in order to start your first battle, you'll need, take note of this, a, pet, a battle pet gauge. Six pets that are capable of becoming battle pets. Check info on them. 40 world locks and a battle leash. So get a cage and start jamming some pets into it. Notice, don't get too attached to your pet's amazing powers. Pet battles will still need balancing and probably always will. If your pet abilities win every fight, you can bet we'll nerf that. On the other hand, don't throw away those weak pets. They might change too. We plan to make a lot of changes to pet abilities as we see how they play out with thousands of players battling. It's pretty insane. Actually, I've never seen this update available. I'll have to check that out. Anyway. A brand new update. Unfortunately, I don't have any of the items. I can't really demonstrate, um, and I wouldn't want to waste 40 world bucks on it, but I can show you something real quick. Okay, right here, I actually have a butterfly leash. And if we check the info on it, this can be trained as an air battle pet. Here, you guys can see the guide made by indicative Forums, rtsoft.com slash forums. Be sure to check them out. Pet battles are here. I've just read you this. Pet battling. It's a tricky hobby to get into. You need to be dedicated. To get started, you'll need the basic stuff we already read. Put it into the cage. You can see here. Are you absolutely sure you want to permanently destroy your Valor Proto Drake leash to make a battle pet? Once caged, a battle pet can never be removed because it becomes too dangerous. Destroying the battle pet cage will also destroy the pet inside. Then you splice it with two other pets, which cost 10 world locks each. And then you can gene splice a new ability into your pet, or replace the current one. Each splice is 10 world locks, and the pet used is lost forever. Without the special items, you can only combine pets of the same ele elements. Uh, that picture doesn't want to load. Now you have a fully spliced battle pet. All battle pets need to have three kinds of DNA in them to be usable in battle. Put your new battle pet in your battle leash. Now your battle pet cage is empty, so you can use it to splice together a second battle pet. Put that one in your battle leash too. Finally, you have fully loaded battle leash and you're ready to take on anybody. Equip it and either wrench a player who has one or punch a pet trainer. Either way, you're in for a fight. Once you have everything ready, it's time to learn how to battle. You can call the trainer by using training whistle. You won't get a new pet, nor lose your pet during the battle. If you win by fighting a trainer, you'll receive a medal. This is a trainer. Yet again, another trainer. New items that have been added. Medals have been added. You will receive a medal. You can get the whale block, which you can buy. You can buy a pet trainer cap. You can buy genetic resequencer, so you can change the element. You can get a buckle design. A CRISPR technology allows you to splice unrelated DNA strands to get different elements. A thinking cap. And a phlogiston. Summons a living flame pet with enhanced range. Other than that, we have the basic stuff. We already know about that. And the glossary, here we go. So, these are the current descriptions that we have. Um, interesting. If you guys did enjoy this video, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.
Hope you guys did enjoy that video. If you did, be sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Check out my social media down below. Check out my Twitch right above my head. And uh, if you did enjoy this video, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.